Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. Today I am here with a new topic on Jamarin form. I am trying to make a tutorial series on Jamarin forms. At first, we have to know what is Jamarin forms, what is the use of Jamarin. Jamarin is an open source app platform from Microsoft for building modern Android, iOS and Windows apps with C Sharp and .NET from a single shared code base. Using C Sharp, we can develop Android, iOS or Windows app. For developing application, we have to set up our development environment using Visual Studio 2019. Let's set up our development environment. You have to install Visual Studio 2019. If you already have Visual Studio 2019, you can add the mobile development with .NET workload. Select Visual Studio Installer. If an update for Visual Studio 2019 is available, an update button will be shown. Select into update before modifying the installation. Find your Visual Studio installation and select modify. Select mobile development with .NET and click this modify button. You will find the modify button here. I have already installed it. So there is not this button. Just clo close it. Okay. Now it is ready for mobile app development. Now my Visual Studio is ready for apps development. Let us create a new project. Just click create a new project, select mobile from the project type, you will find mobile app, jam forms, select, just click next, give a name of this project, my first app. You can change the location from of your project. Create. You will find the template template flyout page tab and blank and just checked Android and iOS both. I will select Flyout template and just create. You will find three project. It will take time to load. A specific version of the Android is SDK are required to build this project. If your machine is missing the required SDK, you will see the following prompt. While the new project is loading, just click accept. to automatic installation begin it's downloading Android SDK command line tools 2.1 you will find three project one is the main project and Android my first app dot Android and my first app dot iOS you will find app dot XML and here is the main page is the app shell when we will start the project it will run with app shell we have to set up android emulator
if this is your first time to building a Jamron application, you will need to create a new Android emulator. You will see Android emulator in the debug menu. Click it to start the creation process. There is the basic Android API level 28 and default Android device. Let's create. Accept. Okay, my emulator has been created. Once the emulator has created, you will see a button that say start. Just click it. Hyper V is not configured. Turn on Hyper V feature so is to navigate hypervisor and accelerate your emulator. Okay. from windows feature you have to select hyper v just click on it we need to reboot our pc just click restart after restarting your PC, you will find the Android emulator is ready for uh, this application. Just click on it. The application is deployed on this device. Your Android app emulator has now been created and it's ready to use. Okay, it's good. So my app is ready. You will find this app is running smoothly. Okay, that's good. The next time when you run Visual Studio, the emulator will appear directly in the debug target menu, target windows, and will start when you select. Okay, thank you very much for watching my video. In my next episode, I will show how to create label, button, and entry. So, no more today. Thanks.